1936, a Wise County, Virginia school teacher, the national press dubbed the Hillbilly Girl, Edith Maxwell, was found guilty of the murder of her father in a second trial after the first one was overturned on appeal. The two had been arguing about Edith staying out late at night and the coal miner had tried to whip his daughter for it. The argument ended with Trig Maxwell's death. The defense contended that Maxwell died of natural causes and not as a result of blows from a blunt instrument alleged to be a high-heeled shoe wielded by Edith, as the state had argued. The jury returned a guilty verdict on second-degree murder, recommending 20 years in prison. By this time, Edith Maxwell had become a media sensation. Many prominent people, including Eleanor Roosevelt, appealed for her release. She was pardoned by Virginia Governor James Price in 1941, after which she changed her name to Anne Grayson and moved to Indiana, where she passed away in 1979.